I'll be showing how to create a switch. Create a new entity and change its class to prop anim interactable. Open the model browser and search for anim interact. Here you can see various interactable models like the crank wheel and door handle. Select the model named Franken switch. This switch has a matching base model, so create a prop static and change its model to Franken switch body. Align the base with the wall, then align the switch with the base. Notice that the switch's bounding box extends out on one side. This extended side should be facing the base. It's important to give visual and audio feedback when a player performs an action, so next we'll add sparks. Create a new entity and change its class to Info Particle System. Give it a name. Click the Browse icon in the Particle System Name field and search for Electric Spark. Select Electric Spark Follow Small. Uncheck Start Active. Align this entity with one of the bottom contacts of the switch base and duplicate it for the other contact. Create another entity and set it to a point sound event. Give it a name and then open the audio browser. Search for Spark and select one of the results. Align the point sound event with your Spark particles. Open the properties of the switch and go to Outputs. Add a new output, on completion A, the name of your sound event, start sound. Add another output, on completion A, the name of your Spark particles, start. Copy and paste this output, change the via this input field to stop, and change delay to 0.5. If you don't want the player to be able to move the switch after they've pulled it, add a fourth output and set it to on completion A, exclamation mark self, lock. And now you have an interactable switch with sparks.